guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Sunday. Today is technically my day off. And by day off, I mean, I don't have any classes to teach or clients or events. It's a me day, but I'm still gonna work a little bit because when you work for yourself, the work never stops. <laughs> uh, but I thought it would be fun today to film a productive day in my life video what I'm going to get up to today and what is a productive day to me. So the only thing I have planned today is yoga at 10.30 and then I have a group coaching call with the babes that are in my 12 week program. I have that at five, it's an online coaching call. Other than that, just basically getting myself organized, cleaned and planned out for the week ahead to set myself up to have a great week. Plus, just do some personal things that I've been unable to do all week because I was so busy. So, currently walking the dogs, and then we'll get this productive day started. First things first, I need to clean all the dishes from last night. I had my friend Laura, who you probably know from my Bali vlogs. She came over for dinner last night to meet the new puppy. We made black bean burgers and we were having so much fun cooking and hanging out and catching up and chilling. And I just left all the dishes in the sink. I was like, oh, I'll worry about them tomorrow. It's so unlike me, but we were having so much fun that I just didn't want to deal with it. So now, to do them all. I hate waking up to dishes. That is a pro tip. I always clean as I go so I'm never stuck with like a giant mess. It's once in a blue moon. Today is one of those days. So I'm gonna get the house cleaned up before I have to go to yoga, feed the dogs, and kind of straighten up a bit.
Okay, let's go to Laura's and lay out by the pool for a little bit, get some sun. I almost didn't go because I do have work that I need to get done, but I feel like, especially lately, my life has been really out of balance. I've been working a ton and not relaxing enough. And then that in turn, I think has been creating really poor sleep habits for me. And I've been having trouble sleeping and waking up and also just feeling a little bit burnt out here and there. And I just think it's really important to cultivate and create balance in your life. And part of that is not just working all the time and being super productive as far as your to-do list goes, but I also think that that entails taking time for rest and relaxation and spending time with friends. I did have dinner with Laura at my place last night, which was really nice and I really needed that, but it would be so nice to enjoy this beautiful weather. What a waste it would be for me to just stay inside all day and work, which is what I was gonna do and which is what I normally do, which is what I've been doing for so long, but I feel like I need to take advantage of this beautiful weather and enjoy it. So that's what I'm gonna do. The smoothie, by the way, is so good. Wow. Okay, that was so nice and much needed. I had such a nice time just relaxing in the sun with Laura and catching up. I really only spent an hour there and then I came home, showered, threw some veggies in the oven to roast and now I'm prepping for my live group coaching call with uh, the women who are in my 12 week yoga inspired self discovery program, the yoga inspired life and I'm going to schedule in my workouts for the rest of the week to get myself set up and just kind of hash out my schedule and I think I'm also going to do a little bit of time blocking as far as what tasks I want to complete for the week and what days I'm going to do that and just get really clear about what's going down each day and so those are the girls from my coaching call. Let's see. Okay. Um, yeah, just so that I have an idea of what's happening this week so I can feel organized and not overwhelmed by everything that I need to get done. I always have a list of things I want to do and need to do, but I tend to kind of leave it up to fate and decide the morning of. But I think this week I'm going to try and come up with a rough schedule of what days I'm going to do what so that I can just be better organized. And of course, if something changes or I need to shift something, then I'll go ahead and do that because I think the key to having a fluid week is staying flexible. But yeah, I at least want to kind of get a rough idea of what is going on this week so that I can feel productive and on top of everything I need to get done. Oh my gosh, I just finished my first live group coaching call with the amazing, incredible humans that are doing my program. And that was so amazing. It was so cool to like connect with them face to face. And I'm so, so, so excited and inspired by all these women that are in my program right now. It's actually gives me full on goosebumps. I have the chills. Do you see that? Can you even see that? Chills, hair standing up, so cool. Time to make dinner 
and then wrap this productive day up. It's almost seven o'clock and I made some roasted veggies and I'm going to make some Thai curry right rice and enjoy my dinner. Might watch a documentary or something cool. And then I'm committing to at 9 p.m. getting in bed to read to set myself up to have a very productive morning tomorrow. Well, made my dinner, watched my documentary, which by the way, if you're looking for a really good documentary, you should watch Game Changers. It's on Netflix right now. It's so good. It's all about plant-based athletes. Highly recommend. Uh, but I got so involved in that documentary and was so tired that I forgot to end this video. <laughs> Whoops, my bad. Uh, so it's the next day and I just wanted to say thank you so much for watching. If you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up. When you do that, it really helps my channel and helps my videos and I would really appreciate the support. And if you want more videos like this, let me know in a comment below. I love watching videos like this, but I'd love to hear what you like to watch. Also, if you're not subscribed to my channel yet, hit the subscribe button. I upload new videos every single week. I would love to have you a part of my YouTube family. I also post on Instagram every day. If you're not following me there, make sure you head over there and do that. I'm at Shayla Quinn. The link to my Instagram is in the description box below. I hope you are inspired by this video to have a productive day, whatever day you're watching this. All right, I'm out of here. Time for me to go teach yoga. I will see you in my next video. Bye. <laughs>